Hi there, I wanted to do something different than a yard sale haul today. I wanted to show the way that I've incorporated some of my yard sale flea market thrift store finds into my home. So I'm gonna to try to move quickly and just show you, um, you know, point out a few things I think you'd like. These baskets I got for $3 recently. They were in a video I made recently from a thrift store and I just painted chalk paint on them and put some lamb's ear. I just thought that would be a cute, like, light summer look. I usually have three plates hanging there. And this dresser I stripped recently. I got it at a thrift store and I absolutely love it. This one is, this dresser, it's old, but it's very functional. The drawers are just full of stuff and it comes in really handy. This old basket I got at a thrift store. I know in my Christmas videos you've seen that with a tree in it but I thought I'd show you how I have it in the summer and spring. I just love stacked ironstone. And I pay, I would say no more than $3 ever for a piece of ironstone. I can luck out and find them at a yard sale for like a quarter and I just can't pass it up. <laughs> I stack that. This is an old antique folding table, like a card table. And I just stuck it to the wall and it has a pretty design on it. But when I found this, five dollar rusty piece of metal it's an old ceiling tile at a flea market i decided to just have my husband brad nail it on there with a staple gun and i love how that turned out i showed you this table recently i got for six dollars at a yard sale this summer and i absolutely love it. it's very functional it's so big this is where i charge my ipad and my phone um, i've got my coffee warmer there this is where i sit and read every morning and I just love the size and the color of it. This is on my coffee table, and I know I've showed you this um, in the winter with my Christmas tree and jingle bells and everything, so I thought I'd show you how it looks in the summer. I have a timered candle there, and you know, a more stacked ironstone, this old scale, and a corbel that I got at a flea market. And this is just how the fireplace looks. It's very ornate in the winter. I do a lot for Christmas on it, and I kind of miss that can't wait to do it again but this is how it looks in the summer very simple I have some stacked plates and a corbel that I got at a flea market this is a dresser that I got on Facebook uh, marketplace for $30 and it also is very functional I have some of the girls things in it and I took their picture down for the video but I keep a, just like their most recent school picture there and I have this flea market corbel and this beautiful glass bowl I got at a yard sale and over here this is my one of my top yard sale finds ever I got this old and it's very old this old dresser for $20 and the drawers on this aren't as functional they're very hard to pull out so I keep Christmas decor in them so I really only ever have to open it like twice a year and I've got more stacked plates right there I found this really neat little box at our local thrift store for two dollars and I'd had a stool there but I moved it I have a lot of stools so I thought I'd try that just to kind of elevate right there and I got this I showed last year this little cup had a succulent in it and I got that for I think a dollar at a yard sale this dresser I got at a yard sale <laughs> it's highly functional it's 25 dollars it's a kid's dresser and it's not that old I love the shape of it I keep all my kids' sports things in there. So their t-shirts, exercise shorts, um, and all their spandex and sports brawls. That's why when they have practice, they can just come in here, grab it, and go. I got this beautiful white old frame. It was around a mirror, and I think I got that mirror for a dollar. My husband took it apart, and it just happened to fit on this wood sign that I got from Lowe's years ago. And I love the way that looks. And I have this old stair piece from a stair, and it I got that for maybe a few dollars, like a junk store. I got I also got this door. The back piece on the shelf is an old door, and it was green, and I painted it white. I have an old corbel from a flea market, and more ironstone that I just have stacked in here. So that's kind of the look on this side of the room. These couple of items are very recent things that I showed. I had got this candlestick at a yard sale. It was new with tag and I paid $3. I think it's so pretty. 
and I want to get a light um, like a timer candle to put on there and I also got this fluted bowl I showed recently from a thrift store for $2.99. It's iron stone. I think it's so beautiful. Okay, this is very recent. I showed this little basket that I got for a quarter and I keep our coasters in there, which is nice for this table. And I have these little stacked bowls. I got this summer at a yard, so I think I got all four of those for a dollar. And this little pitcher I got at a yard sale. And just in my most recent video, I showed this candlestick that I got for 25 cents. It was covered in wax and I was able to scrape all that off. And I just put this old flower that I've had forever on there. This is another one of my favorite finds. I got this dresser at an antique shop for $60 and it is very functional. I have it filled with like kitchen things that I don't use that often and also some decor that I kind of switch around. I love the way that looks. I got these plates at a yard sale. I know I've showed those in a video. I got a huge stack of these plates for $5. They're Pioneer Woman. These are the cookies that we ordered for my daughter's graduation party. And <laughs> we had so we had a lot left over and I froze a lot, but I thought I'm just gonna set these here until maybe I have to throw them away or they fall apart. I thought they were so pretty. And this is from a yard sale. This temporary, I think it's really old. And this corbel is from a flea market. And my daughter made that fine. I've shown another fine from this summer. I got a bunch of pieces of this Falls Graph Heritage pattern. I want to say I got them for like $10. I can't remember, but I showed those in a video. And here's how I used one of them. And then this bigger one I use every single day. I make iced tea in this every day. So that was a great find. I really love that picture. Okay, I'm gonna stop this video here. I do have some things in the dining room to show you. Paige moves tomorrow. It's completely full of the stuff that we're gonna to take to her apartment. So I will have to do that another day. I just was gonna show my entryway. Got those things at a, like a junk shop basically. And just corbel from a flea market. I think it's fun to show, you know, I show when I'm out buying these things, you know, what I get at yard sales. So I thought it'd be kind of fun just to show you a few places in my house where I've actually used the items. So thanks for watching.